After you unzip the downloaded file, you can open it up and see the file structure within it. Notice how there are two versions of everything with the same name. We have bootstraptheme.css and bootstraptheme.min.css. And the same goes for JavaScript. When a user opens your web page, or rather, when their browsers open the web page, they'll have to download all of the style and JavaScript files that you've included in it. Sometimes these files can be quite large. So to help avoid that problem, we use minified files. Minified CSS and JavaScript files take up less space and can be downloaded faster. On the left side, I've got the unminified, the normal version of Bootstrap CSS file open. Notice how it looks pretty normal. But on the right, I've got the minified version of the same file. These two files are the same, but all the white space has been taken out of the minified version, while on the unminified version, it's still readable. You should always include the minified version of your files on your site so they can be downloaded faster. But when you're editing, you should definitely use the unminified version, otherwise you'll drive yourself crazy trying to figure out what's going on.